this is Flutter of the Day and let's talk about the Sliver App Bar. If you want to create something like this, I will show you how to do it in this video. Inside an empty scaffold, we will create a body with a custom scroll view. Inside the custom scroll view, we have the argument sliver, which is a list. Inside this one, we will add the sliver list with the word sliver inside. After, we will create also a sliver app bar. And inside the sliver app bar, we will add the pinned, floating, snap, and title. Now we have a sliver app bar. When we scroll down, the app bar disappear and it appear again when we reach the top. And let's talk about the floating. If we put the floating as true, you will see that now, as soon as we scroll up, the app bar will come back. If we want to use the snap argument, we will need to change something inside the sliver app bar. I just created an expanded height and a flexible space. You will see this flexible space right there. And because the snap is set as true, as soon as we scroll down, everything will come back. But if I put the snap as false, if I scroll down, you will see the flexible will stay at the same level. Now, if we put the pinned as true, the app bar will stay, but the flexible space will disappear. If you want to learn more about Flutter, you can check our Flutter course in the description. Also, you can click the playlist on the screen to see more videos about Flutter of the day. That's it for this one. See you tomorrow. Bye.